start shock line. It's gonna sit. This is our top piece. We know that because it's the one that's a little bit bigger. And of course, I'm putting my glue for me on the piece that is smaller. I'm also using this uh, chip brush to spread it out, making sure we're on there very nice and square. Wood glue is hard after an hour. But it's not truly, truly bonded and changed the chemical makeup of it, the compound, for 24 hours. Um, next step, I have set this and changed the angle of my bench saw to a 5 degree angle. It's leaning. So we're going to cut this on the bottom and we're just going to cut, like I said, a 5 degree. So it's actually going to tilt back just a little bit. You know it's kind of funny to me because I think I've done this before, but I used that cherry stain and absolutely hated the way this thing looked. Um, I just I, I just need to get rid of that stain because I don't like it. I don't like the way anything turns out. So I just super simply went over to my cans of spray paint. I just grabbed the matte black. I didn't want it to be like too loud. I didn't want it to be red. We have a very basic, very simple, you know, functional, functional uh, piece here. Uh, this is you know version one. This is prototype number one. I mean, others have made these before, but for me, so I'll probably make the, the hole here smaller on my next one that might cup it just a little bit more. I may extend this out just a little bit more and then the phone can kind of sit here and that might pull that audio and send it down that, um, that tunnel, so to speak. It sits well. I like that five degree angle that it leans. So there you have it. Just a fun little project.